Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sheena and this is Moms Against Medical Bullying. So I am going to be talking about covert narcissism again in this video. This will be um, with my Christian Covert Narcissist series. So in my opinion, I think that covert narcissists enjoy hearing about how messed up they are. For instance, if you're arguing with a covert narcissist and you're like, you're trying to explain yourself, you're trying to explain what you feel that they have done to you, like the neglect, um, and you start listing everything that they've not done, <laughs> let's put it that way, because in my opinion, with covert narcissists, it's more about what they haven't done than what they actually have done. So what they have done is that they haven't done. <laughs> So, when you start listing out their neglects, I think they like it. They get some sort of pleasure out of you going out of your way, listing everything that they have done. And for an empathic person, I don't think that it would be easy to shoot these things off from the top of your head. Because, in my opinion, you tend to forget you know, what people do, you kind of just like move along with, with life because you're like, you're always giving people the benefit of the doubt. So you're not going to sit there writing lists about all the neglectful things. You're going to try to let them go and move forward. But when you realize that, okay, this is the reality of what this situation is, you start to compile a list so that you don't forget. Because it's like this amnesia that happens. So you take your time, you compile this list. So you get everything from your brain, from storage, down onto paper. Then they want you to explain why. You know, why are you leaving them? What, what, you know, what have they done that's so bad? So you list out the characteristics, explain, and they'll sit there like enjoying every moment of you saying what they have not done, you know, their neglect towards you. If you're in that type of situation, maybe don't waste your breath, don't give them the time of day. The professionals say to gray rock these people. You know, you could explain it once because, again, you know, you explain to people why you're making the decision that you're do just making and why you're doing what you're doing. But um, they'll never agree with you, but they will get subtle pleasure out of you wasting your time telling them over and over again what they have done.